All right, let's check out a guy who is definitely not cursed. Let's see how this one goes. I'm sure there's this short, so there's probably not gonna be an ad, so not ad, so don't get at me. Because I'm not gonna watch it if there is one. Uh <laughs> I probably will. But uh let's check this one out, see what's about. It looks good for you know Halloween time, you know, in, in a sense being someone that's cursed. So let's <laughs> Let's just get right to it. Uh-oh, looks like somebody's back in therapy. I feel like you're not supposed to start the session like that. So what's wrong? How can I help you? Well, honestly, it kind of feels like everything in my odd. life just kind of fell apart all of a sudden out of nowhere. Okay, and when did this no, start? No, hi there, hello. I started my new job this week. Oh, what happened? Well, my boss was being really hard on me, so I very politely told him. Screw you, old man. You've shattered the ancient mirror. What have you done? I'll tell you what I think your fancy mirror. What? And then I spilled salt on the floor and ran out under a ladder. <laughs> Sorry, what is your job? <laughs> <laughs> opens up sarcophaguses and throws out the mummies. Who would pay for that? Not a lot of people, it turns out. Okay. Anyway, oh my God. so related to that, all my plants are dead and birds keep falling out of the sky. Yeah, okay, it's Around pretty clear him, what this I'm is. Sure. My dumb gardener. No, you're definitely got a curse. You're cursed for sure. Eh, no, it's definitely <laughs> for not sure. That. You broke an ancient mirror with what, what did you throw? Just some Native American bones I saw lying around. Because <laughs> the guy was a jerk and he said some real mean things to me as I left. What he said? Oh I don't know, something in Latin or it sounded like he was speaking. Speaking in hieroglyphics, it just sounded mean. I bet. <laughs> anyway, I'm getting worked up about I my bet. boss. Let's talk about something else. All right. Yeah, uh, he's what cursed. What else is new? Well, Fully. Recently, my son was afflicted with um, one of those uh, ancient plagues. What? One of those ancient ones. The doctor says the last person <laughs> who had it was King Tut. Do you see <laughs> this is probably your fault? No, it's because he doesn't wash his hands like I tell him. <laughs> my son can't hear you. Oh, sorry. I've been seeing little hallucinations everywhere. Oh, no. You clearly have like 20 curses going on. I don't think I can help you here. Look, can you just give me some drugs and no. we'll call it even? No. How about just one drug? That'll make no, it worse. don't give drugs. Sure. You think I should go to a real doctor? I think you should go to a priest. Oh, I did go to a priest, actually. <laughs> okay, good. Yeah, he wasn't a ton of help. His mouth kind of filled up with locusts and he burst into flames. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> what? I don't know. Whatever you just oh, no. said made me feel incredibly cold. When oh, I said, no. Oh, my God. Can you stop that, please? <laughs> like, I can't help you. Just go by your boss and you look at mirror or something. Oh, no. I was going to talk to him today, but I couldn't because of the weather. It was sunny all morning. Oh, it didn't rain frogs around you? No. <laughs> Really? <laughs> Probably the worst storm I've ever seen, mainly because it was frogs. <laughs> yeah, it's not supposed to rain frogs. Just my luck, huh? Why does everything bad always happen to me? You know what your oh, real issue my God. is? You can't keep denying what's Come going on, on and blaming everything on everybody else. There we go. Right. Maybe you're right. Maybe I should consider the fact that I'm a little cursed and stop living in so much denial. Exactly. To be honest, I think since I was a kid, I've always had kind of a problem with denial, but I think it's time for me to step up and just... <laughs> What? Oh, sorry about that. I sneezed. For me to step up and just. <coughs> um, this uh is that's that's blood child levels of uh, of creepy. My goodness. Oh, what? Oh, sorry about that. I sneezed. No, you did not. <laughs> no, you did not. No, you did not. <laughs> Uh, first off, I love the little background, like you know, cutaway that we got of uh, of what actually was happening with with his boss with the mirror. Like he he gave a full, well rounded story, background, and everything of why he's in this predicament. And one, he's seeing the wrong person, going to a a therapist or a counselor, whatever the case. This was great. Uh, <laughs> this is one of those ones where Ryan George really puts a lot of story into like what the character is going through <clears throat> where this, this film must be like its own little short film, maybe not a full film, maybe possibly, but for sure a short film. And I want to see Ryan George do one eventually. I mean, he's, I know he's done a lot of different things on the movie mind studios channel. I want to see something that like he has full control over, you know, that's just me. Your thoughts though. Favorite part on this in the comments below guy who is definitely not cursed, even though he definitely was, uh, <laughs> that, that face, was fear inducing your thoughts on the comments below again like the video subscribe if you haven't done so yet and i'll see you guys on the next one take care